In this video, I'm gonna do the get pages index route. So instead of just sending text, I'm gonna get uh, data from the database from the page collection. So to do that, I'm gonna say page dot find, and in braces, I'm gonna pass an empty object, with, which means everything. But instead of adding a callback here now, I'm gonna say here dot sort because I want a specific sorting as well and I'm gonna say here sorting is equal to one which means ascending and then dot exec here to execute that and have a callback in here where I'm gonna have the errors and pages so when I get all the pages I'm just gonna render them out so the view is gonna be admin slash pages which i need to create and i'm gonna pass the page so pages pages let's format this a bit and for the pages view i'm gonna copy and paste this set page and say it's called pages okay and get rid of the form and uh, h2 is gonna say pages now and it's gonna link to add a page so add page here and i'm gonna say here add a new page and now here i'm gonna have a table so the table is gonna have a class of table and table striped which are again bullshit classes and I'm gonna have a T head here with a TR and three THs in here. The first one is gonna say title and this one is gonna say edit and delete. And I'm gonna have a T body here. And now here I'm gonna loop through the pages so before i do that i'm just gonna change here in the post that page the sorting to a hundred because i have the home page which isn't gonna be editable i mean the slug and the sorting isn't gonna be editable the others will and let me actually add a few more pages now so I'm gonna add an about us page, leave the slug empty, say about us here. Submit that, okay. And add a new page and let's say services and leave the slug empty actually and say here services page and submit that. So if I check in the pages collection, refresh this, here they are. It all looks the way it should, so that's all good. And now, in the view, in this T body, I'm gonna loop through the pages and I'm gonna use a snippet I have this time, just like so. So it's, it already says pages here and page here so for each page i'm gonna have a tr and inside of that tr i'm gonna have a td that's gonna echo out the page title and two more tds and just get rid of this so this is gonna be a link to edit the page so it's gonna be an a that's gonna link to slash admin slash pages slash edit dash page slash and i'm gonna have the page slug here so i'm gonna say page dot slug here like so inside of the ejs tags and i'm gonna say edit here and i'm actually gonna copy this td and get rid of this one here for delete so delete page and slash page underscore id this is gonna be 
and say delete here and that looks good so if I refresh this now here it is so this is all good except that I don't want to be able to delete the home page so before this TD with the delete link I'm gonna have an if and I'm gonna say in here if page dot slug is equal to home in that case I'm gonna just have an empty TD here and an else here and just copy that for the close embrace and cut and paste this TD in the else there okay actually I'm gonna indent this back a bit like so let's see now and that's good there's no delete link now for the home so the slug for the home page isn't gonna be editable and also sorting is not gonna work for the home page since if you show the home page in the menu it will always be the first page so I mean the first menu item so there's no point in ordering that and that's it for this video and in the next one I'm gonna do the reordering okay see you then